I once heard a man say that life is a lot like floating down a river. Now this particular river being one we all sat out on equally, though some in more worthy crafts than others. Now some may try to fight the current, changing their desired path and ways for better flows, while others may be more inclined on letting the river lead them to where they belong and the goal that's been overlooked by the rest. Like he's gonna get some video or something. Headed up to the Golden Corral, the Nugget Mine. <laughs> They're all mine. <laughs> So this is the infamous Golden Corral, Golden Nugget Corral. Todd got this nice piece right, right around where below where Adam's at. Hey dude, what's up dude? How you doing? So we've been doing a little bit of digging right here already. I dug down in this canyon right here. Dug kind of where Adam's at. I've done some digging down there. On the other side, there was a pocket of black sand that I dug out. It looked pretty good. Thought maybe there'd be some fine gold in it, but not really, a little bit. We've kind of just been plugging along, really. I haven't been finding a whole lot, but we still have hope. I mean, Almost a one gram nugget came from down in there, so you would imagine that there should be more. Hopefully, the next time I turn on the camera, I'll have some nice gold to share with you guys. I'm gonna work hard for it, that's for sure. digging right over here you see there's a crack I'm gonna continue digging it uh, I'm looking for something bigger because it's right behind this big outcropping right behind the flow and there's a nice crack and it had some really jam-packed what I would call two toes approved material <laughs> two toes approved meaning that it was very tightly packed in there very much worth digging here's where we ended up with that a nice little 
poker picker it's chunk though it's, it's 3d a little bb you hear it River wrap. Adam's river wraps. <laughs> Open a little stand. He's got a sluice box running right next to the stand. <laughs> <laughs> While you're waiting, go down and clear some rocks out. <laughs> so it's about halfway through the day. We just ate. Probably have food all over me still. Um, I'm back to my spot where I got my nice little chunk. It's down here. And Right away, I just did like, I mean, not even a handful of material and got that. It's tiny cracks are jam packed, so I'm just gonna keep working it. It's right behind this mass right here, and this is, I mean, you need to see the flow. Legend has it that in these hills contains ball, balls of gold. Great balls of gold. Great balls of gold. <laughs> <laughs> So I might as well show Todd. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, better told me you got a picker. Yeah. I got, I a, got little a little bit, bit, but that's pretty good. Todd's got a nice hand. Check it out. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah. Hand of the day right there. We'll take that little picker. <laughs> yeah, I like that one better than that ball. Yeah. Me and Adam are gonna have our moss off. Got my pan. He's got his. Who will get the most gold? We'll find out. Visitors. Well, that was fun. Had a great time today. Got some pretty good gold. I think everybody else did pretty good too. It seemed like they did at least. I know Todd had some really good pants that we've seen. Um, I've seen some pretty good pants from Chris also. Adam beat me in the moss off. And Bennett, man, he just disappears and comes back with the gold. So 
I know he said he's doing pretty good today, so I'm sure he has.